hi welcome to my channel if this is your first time of stopping by here hello and if you're my wonderful returning subscriber hello hello so before i allow you to watch this video i just want to make some few um comments here and there i just want to rant the beat you know so this is um popular nigerian blogger blessing mm. yes anti blessing again mm. So Auntie made this video saying that um 85% of married women are cheats. <laughs> and uh, she said she has broken the table. In fact, if you need to do it, she was gingering in the video. In fact, let her break the table, you know, that most married women actually deal with small, small boys and everything. And um <laughs> I laughed in Swahili because I don't think um the 85 percent that she gave was actually true and i don't actually think that it's actually with small boys like looking at things i've seen around most married women don't even like i think the ones who actually go for the small boys are perhaps the ones whose husbands are no more or perhaps the ones who were never married the ones what i know married women mostly do the ones who choose to do what they actually do is they even have female friends you understand well, i don't want to mention names you understand what i mean so she come here and saying 85 percent of that it is the 85 percent that got me um upset because how can you generalize that 85 do you know what is 85 percent of married women that is like almost all married women cheats and you know I, I i choose to stand and tell you it is a deep lie it is it, it is meant to be the other way 99.9% .9 of men cheat and why how many women how many to me the women that actually cheat in their homes are actually less in number and what actually used to push all these women into cheating is because the so-called men they married actually broke their hearts with frequent cheating so coming here to come and call out married women you know making them make them making it look like okay you have broken the table you have not broken any table you did not address the roots there is no married woman that i know that will just get married and she will decide to go and cheat on her husband mm -mm. i believe the cheating started because the man in question cheated and her and she had to cheat back that is just it so all this whole breaking table the men started to break the table first and the women are happy to break that table and i stand to disagree with you no 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 it is not 85 percent because they are still decent more and more than many decent nigerian women who are married and still staying faithful to their husband that's all i have to say if you enjoyed this video please don't forget to subscribe and please like this video thank you you be so short when you see your wife with that small boy what your wife does with that small boy a lot of married women are cheats i'm so sorry to break this table but 85 percent of married women sleep around <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry i'm sorry i broke this table but 85 percent of married women fuck younger boys small small boys You'll be so shocked what your wife is doing with a small boy. She's not cheating because she doesn't love you. She is cheating because you do not satisfy her. She is cheating because you do not communicate with her. Do you know what the younger boy is doing to your wife? Open it for me. You will see where a small boy is doing your wife. Like this. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me. Those things you refuse to do, you are forming ogre. You are forming man. You are raising your shoulder high. Am I not a chief? I cannot do this with my wife because I'm a chief. I cannot do because don't worry. Because you're another woman will help. Another small boy will help you to handle your wife, Mister Chief. Because I got chief tendency type, so I cannot give my wife a head. I cannot put my mouth in a woman's vagina. I can. Oh God, don't worry. When you don't put your wife in a woman's vagina, somebody will help you to do it. Don't be angry. Eh? No problem. That is the reason why. Because when they are with other people, people only enjoy sex when you allow them express themselves so if you are that man if you are that woman that do not allow your spouse to enjoy themselves and express themselves during sex they will cheat on you go and mark it you see all these women that used to act like they are uptights all these women that used to claim holy holy that used to claim church church that used to fuck, form jagabad now they are fuck fast <laughs> all these women that used to be they be forming as if they don't used to shit now then they knock if you see where these girls they knock you go shock if you see where they shout, kill me, kill me, kill me, you go say, ah, what are you talking, what are you talking, are, are you kidding me, are you kidding? Because they have.
have people who help them express themselves. I said you need to learn to fuck and talk at the same time. Tell people what you want. The illiterate of today will not be the men who did not go to school. The illiterate of today will be the people who refuse to unlearn the old things they have learned and relearn new things. The world has evolved. Everybody's talking. It was in our mother's days that you cannot talk about sex. It was in our mother's days you cannot say anything about sex. But right now, everybody's fucking. How come you are fucking and you are not talking? How come you are doing something that you don't even understand what you are doing? Have you ever asked yourself that question? Every day of my life, I'm having sex. Every day of my life, I'm sneaking to have sex. Every day of my life, I'm looking for one day to have sex with. Every day of my life, I'm doing something. And how...